Hi guys, it's Drak Drifter again, and welcome back to JRPG Weekends. Obviously, this will be the last episode for this week, as it's Sunday for the weekend, and well, my weekend in general. Uh, we are starting a new character called Amur. Previously, we've went through three phases. We've met a huge roster of characters. I don't remember a majority of them due to the fact that they just keep popping up <laughs> episode after episode. <laughs> so it just seems like a big mashup of all the characters from the series. Something called Ishtar or something his name is. And then there was another guy that looked similar with just like slightly longer hair. It was, reminds me of Dragon Ball Z. There's always like a new character on whenever an episode. Let's, let's, let's check to see who's got the longest hair and go all the time. So yeah, we're just gonna crack in. Better make this count. Still confused. But I'm sure it's fine. It's fine. Oh scene. She's got one of those things. Ah oh, no, I'm gonna say as well. Okay, stargazing peak. Hey, are you ever going to stop crying? You can continue crying on the ground like that, but all you'll be doing is making yourself hungry. It's not going to do you any good at all to keep the- uh, I... Why are you crying even You didn't have to say it like that! <sighs> this girl sobbing- Whatever I say just makes her- I don't know how many times I've sighed already. Looking at her, ball it's really quite tiresome. It's just I've not had the experience before, but I know and your clothes will be all dirty from sitting everything I've said is the truth This is my first time conversing with anyone other than myself I have no idea at all what's going on in your mind to be entirely honest. How did I end up listening to this? Thank you someone was thinking of it the world surrounding me, I started living in this place that's called Cocoon World Fallujah. Or at least, I think I did. The strange part is that I've been alone in this well. Not completely alone. Quilt is unusual because it has this strange space inside its body that, in fact, my home is... I guess that would make it like my partner. I'm guessing she might be the logical one. The strange thing is that I have no... I've pulled out all the drawers in my head and looked in so I just stopped thinking about it because the reality is at useful tools I need for some reason I immediately know the name sometimes dangerous I have a weapon that I can use so even if I don't know anything about my pet and there's a predictable rhythm too morning comes afternoon comes always nothing motivating ever happens but if it's all just, sometimes I think it would be nice to have challenge. No, I think the lifestyle, my world will never change. At least. This girl, well, it's the first time I think she is the different and she literally did. She's the first person. The problem with that, this whole thing has unsettled me. My heart is fluttering and I just have this, I don't know, restless feeling. How did things end up like this? Yesterday, so how about now? Then the house has already been cleaned, and anything damaged has been fixed. So, yeah. right, that bread just not that we'll need a food. Yes, we can go. But yeah. No, no, I have my gun now that we have a plan for the day. Yeah, yeah. Aww. Here. Yeah. A 
can of beans. I don't think we need to... <gasps> Look at... Okay, I... let's head on back home. Thought, we can't go, Quilt. What if dangerous new... It wouldn't be a problem if it's something I can chase away. But what if they're stronger than that? I am. I am. All right. I probably would, but just a quick understand. I sure hope it's... But it's too late to turn... The light fell on the air. Yeah. Shh. And don't get too at this distance. Quietly. Hmm. Well, I'm just the point where if I said we can just speed it up. What? It's not a tool. It looks like so. There. Yeah. All right. Right, so there's a lot of groundwork left to go through. A lot of dialogue. I knew it. It's not a monster. This is a human, like me. No, she's a robot. She has two legs. She has to. I can't believe there's another. And come to think of it, the flash of light was. Well, her hand. She must be at the very least. What do you think? Yes, it is a hard decision to make. Besides, we need to find. Mm. I said that hurts. Huh? Uh, uh, ow. Huh? You're in Cocoon World. Ah! Don't scare me like that. Who am I? Well, how about we start? I already told you. I heard it the first time, but. Mixed up. I was on my way to investigate the ritual site with Casus, and then this happened. I have no idea what. Where is she? Where's Casus? We were to get. Nobody was here. No, no. I can't help you there. But while we figure this out, I found you only by chance, and I don't like being attacked by. You don't have to be so mean about it. Uh, or I. Now I have to fly and I. Hey, what am I supposed to do now? Yeah. This is starting to get fucking confusing. Why is this confusing? on my head
Mate. Another person? No. I'm on that Sumi. And Cassis. And that pink pink penguin in a barrel. Or stuck, should I say? Fight for fuck's sake. This will be interesting enough. Oh god, my feet! Right, let's begin. Ah, nice. Cool. Reminds me of Nene from Samurai Warriors. Bye. Good enough for me. That works. Oh, we're dead. Oh, we won. Thank you. 
That works fine by me. Oh fuck, I kept those levels. You're telling me Okay guys, it looks like that'll be it for that chapter. <laughs> Thanks for watching some Midnight Six Lost Borders and I will see you on the next episode of Summer Night Six, so find out on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. Bye bye.